Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Your buddy John Megacycle here. Uh, another episode of Factory Town. We are on Mission 5. We just got a couple things patched in. Let's check our victory conditions. Yeah, magic robes are done. Wards are on the way. Uh, magic cloak and health potion are the last two pieces we have to deal with. And I'll just build a forge somewhere for the last piece, I guess. Okay. Magic Cloak and Health Potion. Uh, you definitely don't have what I need. Health Potion. Uh, that doesn't seem very hard. Let's check the cloak. I'll have to do them both. I'm just, uh... Eh. <laughs> I'm, I'm really happy with our little train network that we've got set up. Uh, this one seems simple enough, I think. This is gonna look something like this. And stop. Uh, this can only ever output wool, so that's fine. So we've got wool. I need mana crystals. I need cloaks. Cloaks are done with cloth and leather. Um, I could bring in leather, and I could bring in... Well, I'll need to bring in mana crystals, so that's obvious. We have a flat area I could work with. If you can't just find one, just make one. Oop. That's not what I want. Oh, this camera's gotten all kinds of weird. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's better. Let's go ahead and set up our new line. Um, I will want a rail station to process the goods. Um, and I will want a couple of branch-offs. So how do I want to handle this? Oh, branch-offs could easily be, like, right here. Four, five, I don't know how many I'll need. But then this comes down. Say, drops off. Right there. Links back up. <clears throat> Looks good to me. Let's remove all that. Clean this up a little bit, because I'm a bit of a perfectionist. Oof, that's not going to work. Okay, okay, okay. Good. I need a train station. That looks good. Uh, I need... Leather. Leather and mana crystals. Yeah. I'm not making fabric anywhere, I don't think. Right? Leather. Yep. That looks right to me. Okay. So, let's get the sorters set up and let's get some trains running. Uh, right. <laughs> Ain't nothing gonna help with all that in the way. So, leather, cloaks, mana crystals. Okay, let's resume. Yeah, next. I need fabric, which I can easily do with this. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. What the hell? <laughs> I don't know why that happens sometimes, but it does. Let's put that right there for now. I need a workshop. I need a workshop and a tailor. So maybe something like this will be... Oh, stop, stop. Ah, crap. 
Yeah, I got nothing. It loaded and then immediately unloaded. Okay, I'll have to deal with that in a second. Let's just keep this paused for a moment. Uh, fabric. Tailor. We'll turn fabric and leather into a cloak. Um... This doesn't have to store any of it. So we've got cloak. Uh, I need mana crystals to come out of this. Oh, that goes away. I also need leather to come out of this. Yeah, that'll work, right? Uh, okay, okay, okay. And it doesn't have to be pretty at all. So let's not try to fool ourselves like it's gonna. <laughs> you are gonna do... Leather. Wait, leather doesn't go here. Leather goes back here. Yar! I'm paying attention! <laughs> I'm kind of really excited for this mission to be complete. We've gotten a long way here. Leather. Okay. I think that's everything. That produces fabric. Leather. Cloaks. Mana crystals. Folks, well, yeah, we got it. Perfect. Uh, the only other thing I'll need to concern myself with is the spent mana blocks. Which we're just going to handle thusly. Uh, how does this work? We could do something like this. That's not what I wanted. There we go. Any excess will go into the barn. We could put up a splitter here. Yeah, that'll work. That'll keep the process moving a bit. Um, okay, that's all done. Now, let's talk about loading and unloading. And I really wish that would clear after I successfully pick a thing, but that's okay. Uh, I need a train stop. I need to... Load everything and unload only one thing. The magic capes, or cloaks, or whatever, and that should do it. Other items should just pop on their merry, and that should kind of do it. So I'm waiting for mana crystals and leather. Gold ore, mana shards, shirts, magic robes, cakes, of course cakes, reinforced planks. Okay, let's get the magic robe circus going on here. Uh, magic cloak, whatever, oh my god, whatever it's called. I'd like to see at least one process come through here. There's mana crystals. Mana. There was nothing to pick up, so that makes perfect sense. But at least it's going. Crystals got dropped. They'll get up real nice. Now I just need my leather train. Your wards, your probably cakes. Of course you are. Leather? Gold ingot. Leather? Leather. Okay. Hot diggity damn. Now we're getting somewhere. Yeah, I wasn't sure how long this episode was going to last because the, the making process of some of these items is slow. But that's okay. Leather? Gold. Leather? Leather. Okay, cool. Others should get dropped. I at least want to see two items get produced. 
it's kind of the same methodology from Infinifactory. Is as long as I could see whatever get produced two or three times. Why is that there? Then I'll know it'll work. No, I don't want to grab her. No, why? Okay. Achievement get magic cloak. There we go. Okay, it was actually natively outputting that way. Or organically outputting, or whatever. Okay, we've got robes, baby. We got robes, baby! Cool. Okay. Let's go ahead back up here and reset up that track. Because I don't believe I have it set up. I super do not. I could have done a better job with this, but we are past the point of give a damn. <laughs> uh, we're well past the point of give a damn. I always like to tidy this up so it's incredibly, incredibly, incredibly impossible to be messed up. <laughs> uh, this is the correct way. Right? Right, exactly. Only two sorters, I'll need health potions, and magical cloaks. Health. Oop, not heat. Health. Okay. That should do that. Let's set up the path here. Health potion. Magic cloak. Health potion, go there. Magic cloak, go there. Cool. Now we have all of that set up. That should be no problem. I really hope. Yeah, we're not going to see Magic Cloak probably for a while. So let's just uh, call that done, right? Because we're all set up. We're producing Magical Cloaks. I see nine in the system, and we need 25? Yeah, okay. We're already well on our way. So while that's going on, let's set up this guy. Because this is the last one. We need Mana Crystals. Easy. Fruit juice. What kind is this? Apple juice. That's easy. Remedy. Remedy might be a little tough. Um, what I could do... Uh, this is the remedy, right? Yeah, what we could do... Is something like this. Boom! Remedy! <laughs> no, no, I'm not gonna reset up a new process just to have it last for like eight minutes that's dumb that's stupid stupid uh something like that something like that it's good i need some sorter action i'll just chuck you there for now Okay. I need the potion, clearly. Uh, what else has to come in here? I forgot. Mana crystals. And that's it. So now's the time when I would probably get multiple mana crystal trains running. Just so we could get this going a little bit faster. So this is super simple. I'm going to load up on Mana Crystal and unload Health Potions. And the defunct Mana Crystals go there. Into a barn, where I'll never deal with it again. Can I move this thing? Dang, I can't. That's okay. Okay, there's our remedies coming in. 
So we'll have remedies, red crystals, or mana crystals. I need apple juice. Okay. That's easy. Kitchen. Uh, apple juice. The beautiful thing about that is it doesn't require fire. It has a no require fire. So this looks like this. And I don't need a ton of this, so I don't have to wait forever, but just a little bit to get us going. That should be more than plenty. Apple tree. Cool. That is done. What the hell happened here? What? Reverse? Stop? Okay, just super stop. Can you reverse? Shoot. Okay, what train are you? Mana crystals? Not anymore. What happened? Oh, it turned... I see. I see what happened. This is why I try to be as explicit as possible in terms of how stuff can do stuff. Where can things go? What path can they take? How can they follow? I try to be 100% on that, without exception. But that was a big waste of crystal. Well, it's never a waste. Actually, I take that back. It's never a waste because it just gets sent back to our home base thing. Okay, so how much crystal do we have? We have a fair amount. We can only carry a hundred. Mana connector, mana pipe, mana pipe, mana power. Cool. Skip. <laughs> Not gonna worry about that. Okay, so there's a hundred mana crystal and we have shirts. I'm gonna wait a little bit and we're gonna set up another mana crystal train. Which plank we got? Man, that plank alone has been such good. Such good. That's all I have to say about that. Just such, just such good. Steam Loco, you go there. Cool. Because I've got multiple places where mana crystals are demanded, I kind of figure if we if we load up over here, right, and we need mana crystals here, and here, and, uh, let's see, three, this third place. If I need mana crystals somewhere else, do I need them here? I don't need them there. But if we need them at a fourth place, which I know we do somewhere, um, here, the problem with this is... Stuff might not get all the way around the cycle. Now, I know I'm kind of piping them directly here, so that's kind of a moot point. But still, without having enough trains to ship all the stuff all over the place, this could be a little interesting. Uh, cool. Magic Cloaks are making it back to the shop. What does this do? Clicking annoys the user interface. It doesn't do anything else. Ooh, that's a lot of cloak. Holy crap. Okay. Okay, that was easy. <laughs> uh, we are banking on blue coin now. How much did that net us? Magic Cloak 7 purple? Oh, yeah, purple coin. Right, right, right. Purple coin is the hardest currency to attain, but we are making bank. Okay, we're just missing apple juice. Yep, no big deal. Uh, let's crank you up to max. Max. I've got quite literally nothing better to do. Until this all fires up. Yeah, it takes a while for apples to grow. Which isn't bad. It isn't bad. Uh, split. Might as well do this while we're waiting. If we're going to get a proper amount of overflow for right now while I'm just sitting here, might as well just keep making antidotes. I'm 
wonder if this will work. I think this is cool. I don't. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. That is nowhere near tall enough. So this is going to be just a lucky strike if this works. No, that's that's uh, the opposite of what I wanted to have happen. But that's okay. Cool! Okay, neat. <laughs> That's one way to try to get more freight in the process. Jump you up a bunch. Now we might actually be able to chop through some of this fish. Fish, fish. Apples? Ah, I should have done you first. Forgot I'd have to wait so long for apple apples. Crave apples! You guys have eight fish per thing? We got the excess workers, let's just have fun with it. And I could have sworn in an earlier version of this game there was actually a limit to how many fish were in a pond? But, uh, a spawning area? But I guess not. Like, uh, there's nothing for me to click on. Nothing for me to drag and highlight over, so I don't know. If I do it over trees... I mean, they're at least clickable, they're not... They're not highlightable like that, with a drag selection window. Are you out of? You're out of fire. That's interesting. How? Okay. Right. I get it now. Well, I'm not gonna worry about it anymore. It should be more than enough for 20-something health potions. And we got our mana crystals. I should actually lock this up. Minimuma. Mana, mana. Choo-choo. Health. I think that's everything. Uh, I need a health potion train. You are out of crystals. That's interesting. So let's check our crystal mine. Our crystal processing. Is it all truly empty? Yeah, pretty much. We have plenty of shards. We are kind of lacking on the fire aspect. Let's do that instead. There. Now we'll at least get some level of consistency here. The gold processing didn't really require that much anyhow. And to speed up this process a bit... Ah, oh, goodness. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. Oh, I need a health potion tree, uh, train. I think? To be absolutely honest, I don't need, I don't need two cars for some of this high-end stuff, but I like to keep my trains consistent. Okay. Oh, I guess I only did go one car for some of this stuff anyway. Okay, well, to keep it consistent. Don't want to call myself a liar. Uh... Yes. Boop. Only need one. I don't know how this game calculates drag, or resistance, or tr uh, traction. Train traction, train energy. I don't know how this is all calculated, so... I would assume less weight is better. It'll move faster, right? Pretty straightforward stuff. Hey, there we go. Appley apples. Yep, just go ham. It's not connected. Oh, son of a gun. <laughs> I, I felt it in my bones. 
Why? What? <laughs> that was interesting, to say the least. Okay. We now have the stuff. We're producing the stuff. We have the stuff. Excellent. Are you here for health potions? Awesome. Our first shipment. Toot toot. Now this is well after our break for our town. Our town junction. So this is going to have to go all the way around. And by the time it comes back, we'll hopefully have the remaining 22. Yeah. Because I think he took three. Uh, let's just magic forge. Why can't I afford this? I need 40 cut and clean stone. Do I not have... Wait. Uh, no. I don't have finished stone. Okay, well, this is awkward. That goes away. Wait a minute. I'm pulling in a ton of raw, aren't I? Uh, yeah, I don't need wheels anymore. Let's do this, like, the easiest way possible. Stonemason. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Da-da-da. Stone Borks, get on it! Get on it, Stone Borks! There we go. Now we're freaking. Look at look at that. Look at that. It's just going up like crazy. That's nuts. Okay, so I still need a forge. No, magic forge. Sure. That completes that objective. Now health potions. Health potion train ought to be coming real soon, like. Yep, there it is. For three. I highly doubt we'll have 22 potions ready to go. But that would be really cool. Oh, yeah, we will. Hot diggity dang. We're at 20. What are we waiting on? Nothing. This process is just irreversibly slow. I need 22 to complete the mission. Awesome. We have exactly that. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I like it. I like it. Cool. Second that train makes it all the way around, this is a done deal. And health potions probably just got sold. Oh, where do I take health potions? Oh, right, the apothecary deals with health potions. Okay, who's my potion... potion guy? You. I need you to take potion to the apothecary. That makes way more sense. It's not a specialty good. It's a medicinal, right? There we go. Three sold. I like it. Okay. And we have more than enough of everything in storage to crank out quite a bit more potions. So even if this run didn't make it, we'll get very, very close. But we actually have it planned out enough that this is it. So where is my train? Where's my choo choo? You're not it. Uh, maybe you? Ward? No, no. Looking for one car, guys. You're it. Yep. 22 something? 25. Ooh, a little over. Yeah, these trade markets. I would say cut this mission episode length by two or three episodes. I'd say two episodes easily is how far this got cut down. Because this would have been a monster pain in the butt without the free metal belts, the free railroad tie. Well, not free, but like incredibly cheap. Also the incredibly cheap uh, reinforced planks. Yeah, all that worked out very well. There we go. There's a little Scooty Scoot Jr. I like our little little setup here. This is another mission that I'm I'm really kind of sad that we're leaving, 
but we really got to demonstrate the one-way circuit train network. Works out pretty well. It's not my favorite approach, but it's a cheap approach, easy for adaptability, it just works. So yeah, that's it for this one. Thank you for joining me. My name's John Megacycle, and I hope to catch you next time for more Factory Town. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.